In this month of November, we have some pretty exciting news about Unraid. The first of which is there will be a cyber sale for discounted licenses on November 24th through the 27th. If you don't have a license or you're looking to upgrade a license, that will be the prime opportunity to go ahead and pick up a license. And believe me when I say this, you will want to take advantage of this. And if you are taking advantage of that sale, be sure to use the affiliate link below to help out the channel. I would really appreciate that. Unraid also hired Adam Morales as the new vice president of Global Support. He brings about eight years of experience as a lead from another support department who supported open source projects like OpenZFS and Samba. So be sure to head over to the forums and leave a comment there to welcome him to the Unraid community. I'm sure he will greatly appreciate that welcome. Speaking of the Unraid community, there will be another uncast show. We just have to be patient for that. It is coming. The next guest will be Jos Portvit, and I'm sure I butchered that name and I deeply apologize for that, who is the co-founder and director of marketing for Nextcloud. That should make for a pretty entertaining and educational show. So be sure to check that out when it does release or head over to the forums right now to get your questions asked to him for that show. Unraid has partnered with a company called Link Plus who are the creators of a small form factor NAS solution called the Link Station N1. To me, this looks like a device that can compete with some of the devices that Asus Store has made available that are similar to the size of this device. And what's great about the Link Station N1 is of course it is powered by Unraid out of the box, but it also has some flexibility and storage options should you need them. So if you're interested in a device like this, be sure to check it out and maybe even pre-order it off of their website so you can get it in your hands early. Unraid 6.12.4 is currently available and it promises to fix some issues primarily with Mac VLAN call traces. There's also additional network fixes for Docker, Nginx, NFS, WireGuard, as well as the RPC protocol. There has been an improvement to VM Manager, so it will now retain VNC passwords during updates. There are some web UI changes, like one to the dashboard where you can now hide the ZFS bar if ZFS is not present. There was a fix for subnet sizes within Docker settings. There's also a fix where DNS settings would disappear. And we now have new options available for notifications. There's also several other fixes that have been changed to the web UI, but we're not gonna go through each one of those. I think those were just the ones that I wanted to highlight personally. Furthermore, we have several updates to packages and the kernel as well that should address a lot of CVEs. And we're also not gonna go through those because there are quite a bit. Are you at all interested in beta testing? Well, if you are, in the upcoming weeks, Unraid version 6.13 might need your expertise and help. If you're at all interested in being a beta tester for Unraid, be sure to head over to their website and give them your email so they can send you more information about what it means to beta test and what to expect with beta testing as they open that up to the public. And I wanna go ahead and applaud all of you that are interested in helping out the community because believe me, all of us are definitely thankful for any of the efforts or in anything you contribute to beta testing. That pretty much covers all the content for October and some of the content moving into November. Now there probably will be more news that will come out for November that we haven't covered in this video, but if you are interested in more content like this, please let me know in the comments below and I will continue making videos like this. If not, well, I may make a few more and we'll see just how this works out. So with all that being said, I want to thank each and every one of you for watching and I will see you all next time. Peace.